teacher. Um, she was diagnosed with infantile spasms when she was three months of age. She started developing seizures when she was just born, about three weeks old. So ever since, every single day, she's been having seizures. Um, she now has them about five times in the day. Um, we have tried many different medication. We've tried the ketogenic diet. Um, she's been on the uh, frontline medication, Vigabatrin and steroids for the infantile spasms, but nothing has worked for her. Um, with the ketogenic diet, it has helped her in a way. So basically, she doesn't get the seizures in her, uh, right while she's awake, she only gets them in her sleep now. So every time she needs to sleep, she can wake up with a seizure, roughly about five times in the whole 24 hours. Um, so we came across stem cell therapy um, by somebody from Canada and we were actually interested in, in this because I've heard positive uh, reviews about it. So we looked into it, I did all the research and everything and um, obviously we found it beneficial and we wanted to try this for Khadija since nothing has worked for her. So um, I went on Instagram, I went um, on, online, I tried to find um, different um, places where we can get this therapy done so I came across Stem Cell Care India um, and um, I gave them a call and they actually got back to me straight away there was, um, I actually got in touch with someone in Turkey as well but no one actually got back to me as fast as Stem Cell Care India did um, and straight away they sent me an email um, regarding um, asking me about Khadija's condition I sent them all the details and straight away they, they replied back saying that yeah Khadija is eligible for the uh, treatment um, and then from there we just took uh, each step and um, we went ahead with the treatment. Um, so we came here um, and we got the best uh, like treatment and um, we, we got uh, this treatment done in just one day and everything was spot on and perfect and we got treated really nicely as well. Everything was yeah, spot on. Thank you.